I just was taking it each step at a time and I was just being present. I knew it was prepared. I knew, but when the moment came where I needed to talk about surgery, I... Good morning, I'm Kelly. This is my channel, Incredible Anyway, where I talk about how to live an incredible life no matter what your circumstances are. Dash is here with me. I have to go get Benny off the treadmill. I am... I haven't really thought about how I'm feeling, which it's not good. I'm not feeling good. That's one of my coping skills is to not think about how I'm feeling so that I can get things done. I'm really tired. I didn't sleep very well last night, but today is the day. It is the day that I see my neurotologist, which is Meniere's doctor, four months wait to get into him. My alarm's going off saying, you Benny on the trouble. I talked a little bit last night about what I'm thinking, what I'm feeling. This morning, I'm a little nervous. I keep trying to recenter myself and remember, you know, like just be in the moment, just do the next thing. Um, so that's helping. It's just hard when you don't feel good and it's hard when you've got a lot to do and you got a big day ahead. So I always tell myself my reward is when I get home. <laughs> I live among the waves. Let them take me as far as they want to go. And it's time for me to say They won't break me, I'm braver than I know It's my dad creating mountains where the valleys used to be Gotta change perspective if I really want to My mom is being amazing and graciously driving for me We are headed, as I said, to my Meniere's doctor appointment This is an inner ear disease, if you're not familiar with it and the kind of the last thing that happened four months ago was my doctor retired right before we were going to discuss surgery. Well, we discussed it, but I didn't know he was retiring. So we had discussed it earlier on in the year, and then I had a little bit of a better period, and so I was hesitant about wanting to do surgery. And then by the time I recontacted him, like a month later, he was retiring. <laughs> So I don't know if maybe the retirement was a quick decision. I don't know. Anyway, we're here today and I'm very excited. Um, I'm a little nervous, but I'm just trying to stay present in the moment and just work, let the situation happen and deal with what comes up. So now the biggest thing is trying to figure out where we're going, where to park and all that. Uh, my appointment's at 11.15 and it is 10.07 right now and we're gonna be there plenty early. They wanted me to be there at 11 to continue pay filling out paperwork. I have a ton of paperwork that I filled out and they say in this that there's even more to, that they couldn't send. So I was like, okay. <laughs> so, got a headache. Um, my imbalance and my vertigo are, are okay. They're the best they probably have been in the last several days. So I've got Benny in harness. If I get there and I need my walker, it's in the car, so we're all good. I can't believe today is the day. I just can't believe today is the day. And thank you guys for praying and being encouraging. We could not find if this was the right building or not. So mom, we parked in handicap parking and mom, they have complimentary valet parking because there's so many people. The directions told us to park in the wrong place. So I'm feeling shaky. I'm not feeling great, but we're here. I'm hoping this is it. I'm guessing she must have gone in because I don't see her. I don't see any number or anything. I'm feeling anxious, which I think is normal. Here she comes. Poor mom. My mom is sick this morning. Sick for a while. There's no way I can run anymore. It's 6420 and 6400. Oh. They're both right. Well, okay. I have food to eat. I just think I'm just not feeling great, and so my body's just like the. Well, and we just rode all that way. I'm going okay. to give him the option to like move around here. Okay, I wish I had good. more energy because I could. You want me to do? Well, no. okay. Um, thank you for offering. So we're outside car. Benny does not like long car rides that are bumpy. So Benny, get busy. Giving him some time to just acclimate and calm down because we have the time. I don't think he has to go to the bathroom, but just relaxing. Good job, buddy. So mom found out the buildings are connected. It's gonna be the one on over here. You done? See, he's taught to go into heel position when he's done getting busy. Good job, Benny. Good boy. Go again. 
He's like, I think I'm good. Hey, <laughs> sweet baby. I just had a hearing test and my hearing is what it was in August. So good. Um, maybe not so great for labyrinthectomy, but good. <sighs> I just gotta remember I was made for this. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to Cold Stone. We were, I'm sorry. I'm it was so close. It's right there. I can't get it because I'm sorry. I can't eat dairy, but I am going to live like I kind of want to come in. But I have overcome it all and I'm still Gosh, it's been forever. I like for something different than I uh sunrise over the water. I swam over and under. Get lost in all the wonder, never call the queen snow. When I hit me harder, I went the so farther. I just gotta remember I was made for this. Can you talk to me? Oh yeah. I used to put gummy bears in my Oh gosh, I would never I would put or Heath bar. What are you having in it, Mom? Mom, caramel. It's probably been like 15 years since I've been in a cold oh, stone. Well, Betty. You want to introduce us to them. You don't need lunch now. No, I don't. And I'd rather have this. I can't have anything. Thanks, though. So, Mom got her amazing creation. <laughs> it is, what do you want to tell us what it is? Cake batter ice cream. Um, pecans, caramel, and peach bar. Benny says yum. Yummy. Mm. And she's got to eat it because it's, oh, it's dripping by your finger. Oh, sorry. Kelly. So mom is going into five guys. Good boy, Benny. I got a double wrapped in lettuce and we're, I'm going to enjoy it. I'm really crashing, so I need to well, I eat. I said bacon. There's always wonderings about the bacon. I'm getting a burger. I may have forgotten to say the bacon. It's all right. If I forgot to say the bacon, it's all right. You didn't ask for bacon, but I remember you <gasps> liked bacon. Oh yeah, so I, I forgot. I got you bacon. Oh, thanks, Dad. I got a bacon burger with mayo and lettuce. Boy, I'm glad I got my bacon. Good saltiness. I think I forgot to say bacon. I forgot to say bacon. I feel sad. It's fine, I can live without the bacon. I thought I forgot to say bacon. Thank you for getting it. <laughs> it's all right if there's no bacon. Basically, I just was taking it each step at a time and I was just being present. I knew it was prepared, I knew. But when the moment came where I needed to talk about surgery, I 